Welcome guys to today's video. It was the worst start to the day ever. Trying to make peanut butter waffles and this organic peanut butter. I don't know who would ever buy organic peanut butter. It was my last choice. They were all out of Jif. They were all out of Skippy. All out of nice brand. Nothing left. Only thing I had on the shelves. The only thing that I had left to eat. Organic peanut butter. I go this morning. I go to open the lid and spread it on my waffles. I open the lid and it's so liquidy. I kid you not. It might as well have been lemonade. It just poured out all over the floor. All over my brand new shoes that I just got. Just started wearing. I'm having a terrible day. Terrible time. Do you have anything to add to this? Uh, just that you're very dramatic. It's an awful day. <laughs> I'm so sad. Yeah, it's so sad. It's awful. We're going to have to go drifting and do car things. And it's just going to be the worst ever. I was so sad. She suggested, she was like, you know what? To cheer you up, we ought to, we ought to load the cars up, bring the Z, bring the E36, bring the side-by-side, -side, go back out to the compound and go have some fun. So because of that little peanut butter scenario, we're gonna go have some fun. Um, otherwise, I wasn't gonna do anything fun today, but the peanut butter just made me wanna do some fun stuff. So that's exciting. Are you excited to go wreck your car? Yeah, yeah, no, I'm excited to just, everyone thought I wasn't gonna drive it anymore because it was too pretty and this is gonna just be ripping the Band-Aid off. So I'm gonna get my first stuff and my new paint and my new bash bars. Just uh, break out a little, so I'm excited. I think this is a skate park where Rudnick got hurt real bad. Really? Yeah. Oh no. Poor Ruddy. Rip. I miss him. Yeah. He's a good dude. Now I'm excited to drive in my new interior with actual seats and harnesses now, so I feel like I'm gonna just feel a lot better. Oh, are we gonna expose that today since your content won't be up for a while? Actually, I'm gonna have that up very soon and maybe <laughs> even tonight, so I'm catching up. You're not as far ahead as you think anymore. I'm never ahead. Yeah, well, okay, you're, you're real time, I'm a little back, but I'm getting towed up, so. All right, but anyway, yeah, we're going drifting today. I'm excited to get some proper testing in the E36 in the dry. Uh, first out, I'm probably gonna just go get some logs, send it over to the UC Master guys, make sure everything's looking good, um, and finally put the cooling system to the test, see how it does with the grip, see how it does with the new drive shaft, and uh, go have some fun. Really the only change I made to bring it out of the compound, you'll notice I raised the front end of this thing about an inch, that way if I dirt drop, I won't chip up my fenders like before, so. Front's raised a little bit. I'm gonna take some uh, aggression out of the rear so I don't rub a ton. But other than that, she's gonna be ready to rip. All right, as I said, first laps out, we're just gonna go get some logs. Send it over to the ECU Master guys and make sure everything's looking good on this thing. This car has so much grip for the compound, it's not even funny. So temps stayed pretty good. We're only at 177. However, it looks like my laptop is going to want to close on me. So I'm going to need to strategically place this a little bit better. Gearing wise, second seems good. So I'll pull down a second. Um, probably enter in third. The car feels real loose on handbrake. The way that the E36 chassis works is kind of cool. <laughs> It's still kind of hard for me to gauge speed though. Way too gripped up for the compound. That second to third shift is a little tricky. Probably just gonna take some getting used to the car. Coolant temps were up to 193, still not too bad. <laughs> Gotta figure out that second to third shift a little better, huh? It's like I'm almost wanting to go into first, and I need to go over more. 
That's fifth. Whoops. <laughs> there we go. That's what I wanted. This thing's really easy to drive. Just that second or third shift's gonna really beat on me. Oh! oh one of those times I missed shifted in the fifth. Fifth? Yep. Yeah, but do this thing sounds good and it looks so good in drift. Dude, it's so hard to go from second to third. Yeah, my car did that there too. So I just wanted to get testing in to see how the car would be like in comp format. I went ahead and lowered the duty cycle for boost in half. My guess is now it would be around 500 before it was around 600 wheel. Um, I'm curious to see the difference to see if it stays a little bit cooler not pushing it to the max. <laughs>
how many gauges because I'm fairly certain that uh no, I feel like I might have popped a couple or something, but it's hard to tell. Last time I just lost all boost. Let's check out that other trail. Yeah, that's, that's awesome. time following Sean and then I started trying to leave the car in third rather than doing the downshift in the beginning. It worked so well that I was able to give him a very light scuff. We were so close in transition. Um, also there's a little bump from this guy over here. So the windshield was already slightly cracked okay. from when we did the kill switch and I think it was just enough to make it spread. That's so crazy. I know. Um, there's a chip on my wheel. Like, Is there? So my wheel hit your wheel and somehow that cracked your windshield. I'll take credit for it. It's a pretty cool thing okay. to take credit for. Not nah, okay. It's all good. Really hitting cars and damaging them. <laughs> she brought us root beer floats. Yep. And it's too hot. <laughs> and subs that are not from Subway. 
So that is true. That is true. this girl took an hour and a half okay. to go get subs because Shulman refused to eat Subway. That, true, oh my God. true or false? Okay, done. True or false? Does, right? no. Is that true or false? I mean, did he wow. not? Did he not? <laughs> no, no, it's not his fault. The Subway, like, no, not the Subway place. The place I went just took forever, but it's all good. But, but he refused to eat Subway, correct? Is yeah, that true false. statement? He oh, said, he that. said, you could go anywhere but Subway. Fair, though, if I didn't go to this other random place, we wouldn't have root beer floats. So that, that's a plus, at least. Uh-oh. Subway's calling. No. <laughs> oh, boy. That wheel looks a little hurt. Oh, no. A TE? Yep. Oh. What happened? Oh. It was so nice. Oh. We can fix that. Oh, man. Sad up. So I think I've been driving for like the last hour with a really messed up alignment. Really? It feels really bad. Yeah, I want to play it. Okay. Yep. Yep. Ethan encouraged me uh, with a very cool camera angle in car that you guys already saw, and we got a little too saucy. A little bit. We beached it. It's pretty stuck. good day we definitely smashed up our cars a bit the 36 is uh, definitely been bad. how many times has he stalled it now Three. man we are packed up in here mm -hmm. it's, been 10 minutes. it's pouring we were planning on continuing this drift session all the way home but unfortunately the rain has put a damper on that so I must thank you for watching this video do you have any words Colette um, our cars aren't freshly painted anymore she was getting pretty aggressive with her entries. You guys will have to check it out on her video. When will that be up? Right after yours, because I'm caught up now. <laughs> we'll see. Thanks, guys. <laughs>